What's up? This is Gary. I'm going to show you guys how to go into Adobe Premiere Pro and um, get your Zoom videos to um, come out with about the same file size that they went in with. Um, we're going to go a little bit smaller. So I'm going to start out by opening up Premiere Pro. Here we go. I'm just going to open up a new project and we can, it'll just be untitled for right now. So here's the original, um, the original Zoom file that I have here. Let's have a look at the info and we'll see what we're working with here. So it's an MPEG-4, um, it's 194.2 megabytes. Uh, let's see, here's the important stuff. The dimensions are 1440 by 900, the codec is H.264, the audio format is an AAC, and it's uh, the audio is mono, so it's not stereo. So that's uh, you know half the information that needs to be uh, encoded there. Premiere is really cool. You can just grab something from your finder and drop it into the sequence like this. It's way better to do that rather than to um, uh, try to create a sequence from scratch. This way, all the information is just carried over. It's a fairly long video for being uh, 194 megabytes. It's, it's about 30, 39, 38 minutes, 39 minutes long. Um, so it's really, really great compression here. And that's we're going to try to match the compression when we export it. So let's get to it. File, export, media. It's also a command M if you're on a Mac or a control M if you're on a PC. So we'll start here with H.264 is the codec and preset the top one here, match source, high bitrate. Then we're going to go and mess around with these settings down here a little bit. So um, I'm going to start by just clicking this button right here that says match source. And then the really important thing right here. Um, this setting right here is the most important, bitrate settings. So for the bitrate encoding, I've got VBR one pass, and for the target bitrate, I'm going to change this from 10 to 0 0.55. Then I'm going to go to the audio section, also change that because um, by default, this has the audio recording at a way higher bitrate and in stereo, which we don't need. So for the sample rate, I'm going to put it down to the lowest it can go, 32,000 hertz. And I'm going to change the channels from stereo to mono. For the audio quality, I'm going to say low. And for the bit rate, let's take it down to uh, 96 is an appropriate bit rate. The next thing that Premiere lets you do is if you want to save these settings so you can use them again, um, you can do that up here with the preset. This little guy right here lets you save the preset. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to click this and I'm going to just change the name. Since this is Zoom, I'm going to say Zoom Video Settings. Or just Zoom Video. Why not? I'll know what that is then say OK. So now this will appear as Zoom Video and you can choose it as a custom setting that will appear right at the top. So the next time you're editing out a Zoom Video you can just choose this and it will use those settings. Alright, so let's, let's export it out. So let's go out and see how we did here. So again, just as reference, 193.5 is, uh, is the size of that file. So let me go out to where this is saved. And here is what we just created, um, March 19th. And we can see over here that, yeah, 192 megabytes. So that's just a little bit smaller than the original Zoom meeting. And when we click on this to open it up, 
Can you use that tell a story? So you can see that the uh, the video quality is is still pretty much the same as we started with. The audio is still <laughs> this is a nice picture. Uh, the audio is still really basically the same, um, which is really kind of a low quality audio. Stop signs coming out of his head. So everything's still cool. Um, and we have a slightly smaller file size now than we started with, very slightly. So hopefully that um, technique and those settings in Premiere will allow you guys to keep your Zoom files small and to edit them in Premiere Pro without the file size getting all wonky. So um, that's it. Hope that was helpful. See you guys later.